Once again, we're matching all black all the time. Yeah. So we're gonna be gone for maybe a few hours and Ryan is putting all this in my purse. Like, like why? Why not? Do you think you're gonna be that I'm hungry? One. Sustenance or two tragic events. What, can you just- Earthquakes, tornadoes, inclement weather. You're, you're smarter than this, come on. Like what? All right, so gonna do some coffee on the go. Kohana coffee in just the French roast. I'm gonna do a little water. This coffee's concentrate, so you actually add water to it or milk or whatever you, you know, drink with your coffee to um, dilute it so it's not, you know, making you grow chest hair. <laughs> Cheers. Mm. It's getting ready for a field trip. You that kid in school on a field trip, you had like... Do you mean the one that was always prepared for anything to happen? The one that everyone... Like nothing's gonna happen. Nothing's gonna happen while we're out that you need 15... You seem so certain of that. Hmm. I haven't forgotten about my announcement either. It's coming. It's coming! Ah! Temperature right now. Uh, it's in the 40s. Yeah, cross, baby. stuff is. You make your own cocktail in perfume. Not to mention they smell uh, amazing. So Commodity actually sent me like a whole cocktail kit of all of their perfumes. They're like unisex. Ryan and I can both wear them to like make drinks. It's like the coolest thing ever. I'm like obsessed. One more look at this Sephora. So beautiful. So Ash made waffles and I'm so delighted and just grateful because I love waffles so much. She put so much effort into them. And she brings them to me and it's like... <laughs> Thanks! <laughs> Mine's not like that though. Sure. Listen. Yeah, that certainly See? that certainly doesn't sound like a piece of crispy bacon. Look, I left them in the oven too long. What do you have me to do about it? You're welcome for your waffle. I know I am. Why is tomorrow a big day? Walking dead. Dramatic slow motion montage. One per year. I only two yeah. one per year. I hurt my 
toe. Yeah, but let's talk about something important. No, seriously, you, I opened that drawer over there, and like the bottom of it just scraped right over my toe, and I, I might faint. Why'd you, why'd you put your toe there? That's silly. Don't do that. Skin came off. It's not bleeding, but like my skin folded back. So you're alive. Hey. Care more. Is that a statement? A question? What is? Was that? It's a statement. It? Care more. Okay, you should put that on a shirt. <laughs> We gonna show everybody how we search for music? Let's do it. All right. Usually while we're doing laundry. It's me looking through the internets for songs and I'll play them and we'll see if she starts to boogie. <laughs> walking on oh, looks like we got a chance. Got a chance with this one. what I do to prep my skin before I'm shooting a how to style video or a video where the camera is going to be so up close in my face. So today I'm using my Vanity Planet Skin Spa and I love this thing because it comes with three, three different brushes. This guy comes with a daily cleansing brush, an exfoliating brush, and a silicone brush. And I really want to like get in there and get all my pores cleaned out and really get any imperfections or like dry skin or anything I've got going on. This thing takes batteries so you don't have any weird chargers like laying around. It's super easy to pack because it comes already in a travel case. Couldn't be any more easy than that. Look how gross this is. This is residue makeup from last night and I thought I scrubbed my face so good. So, wow. The exfoliating brush does not play. <laughs> like, I have the smoothest skin right now. It's insane. Definitely gonna be using this brush like twice a week. I'm obsessed with it. And let me also mention that the girls over at Vanity Planet gave me a 70% off coupon for the Ultimate Skin Spa, so go order one. You will not regret it. 70% off, like hello. I will post the link below to where you can go purchase it with your coupon code. What do we think of Ryan's new sweater? Hold on. I think it's so great. Oversized? Little oversized action. Let well, the music turned on right in time. Jared! Hey, Nicole. Hi. Happy Saturday, you guys. Straight hair, don't care. Why don't I wear my hair straight? Oh yeah, that's right, because I have like naturally curly hair and it takes forever to straighten. I think I am ready to make my announcement. Why am I nervous about telling you guys? Okay, I'm just gonna go ahead and say it. I am starting November 2nd doing YouTube full time. Oh. I have always worked ever since I moved out of the house when I was 18. I have always had a job. So this was a big leap for me. It was a big decision. It is a big deal. I am fully committed to what I'm doing with YouTube and with you guys and with my channel. I am so invested. It's scary. Honestly, I am scared to death, but it's good. It's good. It's a good scared. I'm, I'm so excited. I decided to do this because now I can invest everything I have into this channel and into you guys. I will be able to talk to you guys more throughout the comments. The Life by Her lookbook is going to be off the chain. So good. The vlogs especially. I want to vlog all week. I want to have 20 minute long vlogs for you guys. Kind of showing like what's going on in my life. With my business. With my YouTube channel. Like I want to let you guys in on that. So I moved from Texas to New York. Because I wanted to fully expand my career in the fashion industry. I wanted to be on more of a corporate level and not so much retail and really like do do it to the fullest, like do it up. And I did that. And after I did that, I found YouTube and I found a new fashion outlet. I wanted something more. And after I started my YouTube channel, I grew Life by Her and that is now my, my passion, my focus and I wanna grow that. It just got to be, um, like hard on myself because I I am working 40 hours a week at my job and probably around 30 hours a week on YouTube and life by her, I would go to work from eight to five, 
you know, come home, sit straight at my desk, work until one to two in the morning, and then get back up at six, work on Life by Her, and then go to work. So that's just kind of been my schedule for the past three months. And there comes a point where, you know, you have to make that decision. You have to get on one side of the fence. I couldn't be fair to myself um, if I kept trying to do both. So that is where we're going. That is where we're moving on. New chapter. Mwah. Love you guys. That's my announcement. I'm not pregnant. No, no babies are happening. I was, I was literally dying laughing when all of your pregnant comments were coming in. Ryan's like, are you, are, are you pregnant? Like, no. I think Lisa, you're the only one who guessed. Like, after the video was live for maybe a few hours, and you were like quitting, you quitting your job and doing YouTube full time. I was like, oh my god, how did she guess that? I, you're so good. What's up, guys? So welcome back to another episode of How to Style. I actually am styling one item today four different ways. I am styling this sweater dress from H&M. 